Why it's more fun when you have to work hard. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. This is Amin with Sarah Masters developing the Muslim mindset for success. I don't know if you remember a few videos ago, quite a few videos ago, I was talking about, you know, should a Muslim watch movies, watch films? Uh, is it haram? Is it halal? I obviously don't give rulings on these things, but I did drop my opinion on watching films in general. And recently being in Malaysia, as you saw in my last video, I uh, came across a situation which I thought was very relevant to that whole discussion. And that was when I went to this park in uh, Kuala Lumpur. It's a very big park and it's jungle and there are hills in it and everything. And, you know, it's an area which the, there's no building at all in it. It's completely closed off. It's only nature. And I went there for a walk, to walk in nature, right? To go through the jungle, to go up the hill, kind of like a trek, okay? And there were quite a lot of people there, you know, just going, it was, uh, I think we got there at 7 a.m. or 7.30, you know, the sun still wasn't uh, that hot and everything. And we were walking and walking and it was quite humid and we were sweating and we were going uphill and there was jungle and there was mud and there were these little rivers and we were struggling, okay? Um, and we're going up uphill you can imagine the spiders the bees there's birds everything we're going up uphill it took us about an hour to get to the top of the highest hill in that uh, kind of park and once we got there we just felt refreshed we felt relieved you could say you know we were struggling we were out of breath sweating a lot we get to the top and we're relieved right we did all that work and we're relieved I wouldn't say we're over the mood the view was not spectacular, but we were relieved. Then we're like, okay, now we gotta go back down. So now we're walking down, 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 down. Alhamdulillah, it didn't take us that long to get down, not as long as when we got up. But then when we finished, we got out of the park, we went, we had breakfast, we were happy, we were satisfied. And that's the point I want to drive home here is that when you put work and effort into something, you commit to it. And when you get a result, i.e. you get to the top of that mountain, you do that, you, you get past that challenge that you had of being tired, you, you accomplish something, that is when you feel satisfied. That's when you're truly um, happy, I would say. That's where true happiness comes from. And likewise, uh, or not likewise, but the opposite side is uh, watching films or playing uh, games, video games, is that you could not, you wouldn't be doing that thing for one hour, like, climbing up that that hill uh, but you might be playing PlayStation for three hours you might watch a two-hour film and when it's over what do you feel you do you feel relief no do you feel satisfaction no it was only during that short period that you were doing that thing that you felt like oh I'm being I wouldn't even say enjoying I would say I'm being distracted I'm being entertained but it's just a shallow level compared to when you put work in something, some kind of effort into something, you get a result, and the result, usually you feel the satisfaction for a few, many hours, or for days, or for weeks, or sometimes for your whole life, you will hold that satisfaction in your heart because of the effort you put into it. And so, that I want to recommend to you to, I'm not saying don't ever do these kind of short-term entertainment things, but always realize that real satisfaction, real enjoyment comes out of stuff where you have to work, where you have to put effort, where you have to commit. Stuff like uh, exerting yourself physically, stuff like working, like, I don't know, like these videos, I have to think about what I'm going to say. Obviously, I have to read and I have to think to have stuff to say. And then I have to film it, I have to edit it, I have to upload it, uh, send it to my mailing list, etc. This is effort, but that's precisely what makes it um, satisfying and I think that's what we should chase is satisfaction and contentment rather than uh, entertainment and distraction okay so something to think about you know why don't you drop in the comments things that you do that you find very satisfying maybe it requires some work but in the end it does give you satisfaction for me I just shared something like trekking like walking in nature um, that is something that you know I found most recently to bring me satisfaction after putting in a lot of work so thanks for watching. Assalamu alaikum and I'll see you next week. Insha'Allah.